Welcome to a comparative billing report training on how to make a CBR work for you, created and presented by the National Government Services Case Management Team. CBRs may be new to you, however they are not new to Medicare. CBRs are disseminated to the Medicare provider community to provide insight into Medicare policy and regional billing trends. The CBRs that are distributed to the provider community contain an analysis of billing practices across geographic and service areas. Medicare Administrative Contractors, or MACs, have been producing and disseminating comparative billing reports to providers in their jurisdiction as part of their provider education efforts for many years. Today, we will help you determine if a CBR was mailed to you. We will further explain what a CBR is. We will help you understand why you received a CBR. We will share how CBRs can be helpful, and we will discuss the next steps for you. CBRs include an introduction and graphic as noted on this slide. Be sure to keep this letter and share with appropriate staff members, including those providing services and the billing staff. This letter and potentially a change in practices may help to improve your organization's billing efficiency. A comparative billing report provides comparative data on how an individual healthcare provider compares to other providers by looking at billing patterns for services, beneficiaries, and diagnoses. The CBR offers the results of statistical analysis that compare an individual provider's billing practices for a specific billing code with the billing practices of that provider's peer groups, as well as national averages. A CBR is unique to a single provider and is only available to that individual provider. The billing data provided in this report is reflected of your billing and can assist you in comparing your Medicare billing with your peers. If you have received a CBR, it simply means that through data analysis, National Government Services has identified your billing as being significantly different when compared to your peers. We are not asking you to provide any medical records at this time. This letter is simply informing you that we see potential variances and we would like to let you know what we are seeing. Many providers may feel alarmed when they receive a CBR. CBRs are meant to be used as a tool in helping providers identify and understand potential problems with their billing. A CBR educates providers about Medicare's coverage, coding, and billing rules and acts as a self-audit tool for providers. Your CBR will not only include graphs to illustrate how you compare amongst your peers, it will also provide you with an educational resource that can be used to help you better understand coverage, coding, and billing guidelines. Let your CBR work to your advantage. It can be used as a helpful audit tool ensuring your coding, billing, and documentation are appropriate. Use your CBR as an opportunity to self-audit your practice. Review the information and educational tools that are provided. You do not need to reply to the CBR. If you have any questions or would like further education, help is always available by reaching out to our case management team. If you have any concerns or would just like to request additional education, please reach out to us. The email address to reach out to us is also on your letter as well as this slide. We hope you have a better understanding of the purpose of CBRs and we hope to hear from you with any questions or concerns. Thank you for viewing this presentation.